Hi friends, welcome to Biology Exams for you.com. Today we are going to discuss about what are plastids and what are the different types of plastids with example. Three major types of plastids are leucoplast, chromoplast and chloroplast. Let's begin with definition. Plastids are self-duplicating membrane-bound cytoplasmic organelles found in plants and in some algae. The function include synthesis and storage. Synthesis in the case of chloroplast, whereas storage in the case of leucoplast and other plastids. There are three main types of plastids depending on the color. They are leucoplast, chromoplast and chloroplast. Let's have a quick summary of different types of plastids. First one is leucoplast. It is colorless plastids and meant for storage. They are storage organs. There are three types of leucoplast. They are ameloplast. Amelo means amelos, that is starch, storing starch grains found in potato tubers, rice, etc. And the second one is alluroplast, that is alluron grains that is, in, that is associated with protein storage or store proteins that is found in maize grains. And the third one is aleoplast, that is storing lipids and found in endosperm of castor seeds and many other seeds. And the second type of plastid is chromoplast. As the color indicates, it is red, orange or yellow. All other colored plastids other than green can be called as chromoplast. Chromo means color. It develops from chloroplast or leucoplast. Classical examples include the color of fruits, flowers, etc. Then the red color of tomato that is due to lycopene. Then in algae there is phycocyanin and phycoerythrin in red algae. Then in brown algae there is fucos and then all are chromoplast. So chromoplast are plastids that is involved in synthesis of pigment and storage of that pigment manifesting a color. The function of chromoplast is to attract pollinators and also for dispersal of seed as in the case of higher plants. So this is in the young stage this chloroplast is converted to chromoplast when the fruit ripens. So chloroplast give rise to chromoplast and finally chloroplast it is a green chlorophyll containing photosynthetic plastid that is found in blue green algae and all green plants and is responsible for photosynthesis and also the production of carbohydrate from the energy that is from the sunlight and that energy is converted to carbohydrate by a process called as photosynthesis that occurs in this organelle that is the chloroplast. So this is the structure of chloroplast. Numerous chloroplasts often seen in a mesophyll cell of a plant. You are with biology exams for you.com. Thank you so much for watching.